Hey everyone, Rigel2 here, and look at this, a naturally generated geode. Yeah, that's right, the first snapshot for the cave update has been released. And yeah, I went to Spectator Moon and found this, and we have two new blocks, Palkite and uh, I have no idea what they're used for, but they're very nice looking. Uh, especially for building, I'm probably going to do a building tips and tricks after when I have time. And we also have the brand new block of amethyst, which, listen to this. Oh, that sounds so good. We also have the amethyst cluster. Oh, that sounds so, so nice to hear. So let's get a netherite pickaxe, and I heard that these, there's also a different type called the budding amethyst, which I believe is what has the amethyst cluster on it. Yep, so that's really cool. So I heard that these blocks can't be breakable in survival mode, so game mode. Survival. Let's see. Okay. They can be broken and gathered. I guess that's a bug. No, but the blocks actually grow these. Okay. The block of amethyst can be broken, but the budding amethysts cannot. Uh, break this, you just get a shard. Alright. That you get the block, that you get the shard. So only the budding amethyst, that thing is locked. So that, that works. Oh, and these things... Okay, these things can be placed on walls. Okay, that's... That, that's... Alright, that's cool. That's cool. Uh, yeah, so let's go into spectator mode. Just to see... If the generation has changed, I don't think it has, besides for the addition of geodes. It doesn't really look like anything's changed generation-wise, so I might be wrong about that. Uh, mine chat. ooh, that's a dungeon. Uh, yeah, everything looks the same generation-wise, so I don't notice any differences here. So yeah, let's go over the new blocks. Alright, so the biggest news, look at all these. Just We'll, we'll get to these in a second, but look at this. We got candles in so many different colors. I don't I don't know how to light these. Would, would you use a flint and steel? You need a flint and steel? Oh my gosh. This is incredible. Oh. Oh, this is... This is absolutely awesome. Oh yeah, we also have the new telescope. Which... Okay, that's pretty nice. I uh, will test out that in a bit. So, the lightning rod has been added. Interesting enough, the new no mobs have been added. We don't have the goats. But if I do... Now, this is found in the redstone section. If I do slash summon lightning bolt, it should... It didn't strike... Okay, let's see. Did it strike it? Okay, let's let's try over here. Now it's in the redstone section, so it should send a redstone signal. Okay, did, since nothing's on fire, I think it did hit the lightning rod, but not directly. That's really weird. What the frick? <laughs> oh, that looks so weird. Oh, this is gonna be great for building. Yeah, it it seems to only. Yeah, that's that's quite quite weird. So yeah, now let's yeah, that is very, very weird. So yeah, we have all these other stuff to go over, so let's do that. So we have all of these copper variants. So first we have the copper block. Looks like this. The lightly weathered copper block, semi weathered, the weathered, the cut copper, lightly weathered cut copper. Semi weathered cut copper, weathered cut copper, cut copper stair, slightly weathered copper, cut copper stair, <laughs> um, semi weathered cut copper stair, weathered cut copper stair, and cut copper slab, slightly weathered cut copper slab, semi weathered, um, uh, you, you, you get the point. <laughs> uh, there are just a ton of new. Locks. And then we have the wax copper 
uh, which there's only three variants of compared to the four of the others. But they look pretty much identical. So this is the preserved state so that they don't age and uh, don't seem to start aging yet. Uh, yeah, and then we have Tuft, which is kind of like a pillaring block based off of the texture. It looks very, very nice. And then we have Tuft. So Calcite and Tuft. Uh, Tuft looks very rough as a texture, but I think these are going to be great for building. Hopefully we get smooth versions of Calcite, so it's kind of like early game quartz. Uh, it seems to just be a stone for now. But yeah, it's looking really, really good so far. Um, they did introduce the bundle, but the bundle doesn't really seem to do anything. Like if I were to grab these blocks, I can't put them in the bundle as they should before. It doesn't seem to work. I don't know why. It, there's nothing I can do to put in it, so I think it's just there for now as a texture. Uh, for the most part, I think that's all they added. They also- oh wait, no. Besides like the ton of candles. I mean, if I were to just search candle, not cab, candle, look at this. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17 different colored candles. And I'm guessing that they also introduced wax, but there's no wax. But yeah, oh, these look so nice. For building and then you light them with a flint and steel um yeah but there doesn't seem to be wax i don't know if these things have crafting recipes uh so if i were to just go here and look up a candle yeah they don't have a crafting recipe at all like they don't uh I, the, the spyglass uh amethyst shards and two copper ingots that's pretty nice uh, all these are from multiple the copper. Oh, what? Whoa, 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 what? 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 What is this? Tinted, tinted glass. What the? What is this? Wait, don't, don't tell me. Wait, 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 wait. This is my actual reaction. All right, let's see. Please don't tell me. Is this... Is this immune to explosions? No. Is it... What? What is this glass for? I mean, it looks nice. It's kind of more... kind of looks a bit like programmer art, but it looks... Hmm. Alright, so starting off, look how gorgeous this texture is. I mean, gosh dang, this texture. Oh yeah, the spyglass has a sound effect, though. that's kind of cool. So yeah, here we have the new small amethyst bud, medium buds, large bud, and amethyst cluster. So the budding crystals. Now they can, they can be placed, it, yeah, they can be placed pretty much on everything as of now. Not sure if that's um, temporary, but I'm pretty sure they grow. Uh, let's see, has any of the copper been? No. I don't know how long it takes for that to happen, maybe it takes speed. Yeah, here we have the budding amethyst which is what will actually spawn the clusters and these don't you can act you can't break them i haven't tested with silk, silk touch but i don't think you break these um but you can break them i showed earlier but i don't think you can collect them but you can definitely break and collect a block of amethyst that's really nice and the clusters they look really pretty and you can collect them and get shards i don't think in survival you can collect them with silk touch you know what let's test that out let's Enchant. Uh, look. Okay, let's see. No. No, it just just breaks in the shards. You can't collect these. Stop saying these things break quickly. Oh wait, I'm in. I am in. I'm in creative mode, so let's see. Takes a while. No, can't. Well, this I already showed. Can you break? Okay, yes, you can collect the crystals with with silk. That looks so weird. All right, you can collect the crystals with silk touch. That is very nice. Can you collect the candles without silk touch? Yes. Okay. How long does this take to break? 
Oh, it's normal. Oh, wait. Oh, you can collect it normally. All right, that's that's good to know. Uh, wow. Dang it. Very nice texture. Must hand it to Chapa. But yeah, that seems to be everything in this snapshot. As far as I can tell, we got a ton of new blocks. We got the spyglass. We got shards and stuff. We only got the geodes. We have no new generation as far as I can tell. And no new mobs, so... Unlike the Bedrock Edition, we don't have goats already, or Snow Your Snow, or Powdered Snow. No, we don't have Powdered Snow. Uh, nothing new here. Like, nothing new. We have bundles, but they don't seem to work yet. No new food items. No new generation, but we got a ton of new blocks, a bunch of new items. And, yeah, it's... This update's looking like it's gonna be... Really, absolutely incredible. We got tinted glass. I that's an actual shock to me. I'm surprised that we got that. We had the new emphasis. That 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 seems to be ever. Wait, I don't think we had red and nether brick stuff before. Okay, that might be a new addition. Uh, yeah. As far as yeah, I think the red and nether brick that wasn't in the nether update. I don't think. Uh, actually, it might have been. Not sure. Yeah, but that seems to be everything. I don't think there's any copper walls, no, or new walls for the new buff and calcite. No, it doesn't seem to be. So yeah, I I cannot wait to see the new stuff they're gonna have. Uh, yeah, the buff and calcite they seem very interesting. I can't. This tint glass, I'm not sure what they're gonna do with it. It might account for something. But as far as I can see, uh, oh, you can craft the, oh, you can craft these with the shards, all right. Glass, I, I don't know what you're going to use that for, lightning rods, just through that. As far as I can tell, yeah, the lightning rod, it's interesting. But, yeah, I can't, the building in this update, this is going to change Minecraft building for absolutely other, this this in the candles. Oh boy, so many new options for building. It feels more like this is going to be the builder's update. Plus, yeah, I think everyone's going to be happy with this update. All right, this is Rigel 2 signing out. I hope that you guys have a great and wonderful day and are just as excited as I am for this new Nether update. Yeah, see you guys next time. Please like and subscribe, and yeah, bye-bye.